day. Good morning, it's April 7th. I guess I'm working in the office again today. And yeah. Yesterday I flew the drone inside here. That drone is really easy to fly compared to the one I had before. It's just so easy that I can fly it inside a place such as this and it doesn't run into anything so far. But it feels like I've got more control and it doesn't wobble everywhere. It stays put when it, wherever you move it to. You know, it doesn't shift or anything. So that's awesome, that's a plus. And I'm really digging that. You know, I've got a lot of paperwork to do in the office. Seems like it never ends. And that's the one thing I dislike, is doing paperwork. Never ends. You know that picture? That's our buddy, Carl. He was our fishing buddy. He passed away, I don't know, a few years ago. If you wanted to know where the fish was biting, he was the man. Not only that, he was a great friend. So this picture I took when the year before he died, it was his last ice fishing season. And I had my camera I took my camera out there, recorded the fishing, and took some photos. He was very simple, a simple man. Didn't need gadgets. You know, he didn't need all the electronics or whatever. Just sat out of his truck and fished with a long pole. It wasn't even an ice fishing pole. So yeah, it's a great man. Never find a man like that. Yeah, and then there's some more pictures. That's pictures of the wife, the boys. They're growing up too fast. And our fleet, landscaping fleet. Don't have that one anymore. Still have those two. Added a new one. So, thought I'd share those pictures with you. paperwork from my account. Now heading back and it's pretty windy out here on the interstate. Still raining. Gloomy. And I think I'm going to go back, get back to the office and take my drone. You know, I was, I was looking at my phone and see my wife updated her picture on Facebook and her cover photo of the of her feet with the tap shoes or whatever she's wearing. And it got me thinking. You 
know, it's, I don't know how this is all going to play out, but when, back then when we were dating, and, you know, all I was into was, all I wanted to do was party and have fun. I never cared about what how my life was gonna turn out or didn't even care about care about me, you know, myself or the people around me. And I just got to thinking when I saw that like the post she updated that and just I'm happy. It made, it made me smile, you know. But she's ever since she was you know, in grade school, she'd been doing the dance. She's been into dance and took dance classes until she graduated high school. And it, for the last so many years, I don't know, 12, 13 years, but we've been together for longer than that. But for the last 12 years, I think, she's allowed me to really focus on my dreams and she's, she's, she's given me that opportunity to just do what I need to do to get my businesses off the ground and along the way she's helped, helped out a lot. And now when she, no, it's it's just I don't know how it's all gonna pan out. Seeing her going through with this, she always wanted to, you know, teach dance and be involved in dance somehow. And now she's gotten the opportunity to do that, and so seeing her getting back into what she loves doing, it's just I'm just I'm just so happy for her. If, you know, like I said, I don't know how it'll all turn out, but at least she's excited about it. I'm excited. Her sister's excited. And now it's her turn. You know, she's because I've got to, I've I've got to do what I love to do, and I'm still doing it. Now it's like. Just, it's just the timing, you know, it's, if she gets back into this and does it all, it's, it's amazing, it'll be, it'll be great, it's, yeah, it's her turn, along the way we help each other, you know, we never, she's never told me not to do this, do that, you know, follow, not to follow my dreams, and I'm the same way. I've never, I'm not gonna tell her not to pursue what she loves doing, or enjoy doing. Because, I think that's, I think that's the most important thing in a relationship is that you're helping each other grow, Long grow and along the way each both of us are just individuals we never try to change anything about one one or the other you know it's, it's so it's it's very important in a relationship I, for I guess in a relationship, I'm not a relationship expert, but it's just letting one individual be the person who they really are. Because that's what shines. That's what comes out of people. Is their person, their own identity. And seeing that, you know, she's, I'm happy, I'm happy for her. It almost makes me choke up thinking about it. And yeah. It's, it's never too late, 
I think to do anything, to do what you love. I always talk about that. And whatever you enjoy doing, pursue it. It, it takes a lot of work, sacrifice, as everybody knows. But it's possible. So, yeah, I'm happy for her. Okay. Oh, man. Because I got to go get the sun, that sun dropping. Oh, man. I'm going. I'm going to get my drone. Okay, bye. Oh, man. Go and get my drone. Go and get the sunset. Where's my hat, bud? Oh, I'll just have to wear this one. Okay. Oh, sun is gonna, sun's gonna set. Okay, bye. bye. Okay, we're gonna go get some footage. I'm gonna go down to the laundromat, grab my drone. I don't, I don't got a tracking, but that's all right. Um, I'm gonna go get that car. That is, I just got a text from my brother saying, "Look outside," and I was at home. And oh my God, it's so beautiful. Let's see if I can get it before it goes down. Oh. Because it's cloudy and at the same time the sun is just setting. Oh man, I hope I can get the drone quick and get out there. Ah, oh, so beautiful. Come on. It's not fast enough. Come on. I don't have much time. I probably got like a few minutes, not even. Come on, I want to get up on the west side of town here again and get that. Come on. It's 8.06 p.m. right now. God, I hope the sun is just as nice as it was when I got out. It's only been a few minutes. But if I can get this, oh, it's still there. Awesome. Right. Oh, come on. That was awesome. Now it's gone. Shoot. 